That's it? We're breaking up? Marshall, I'm sorry. I just I just need to go to San Francisco and do this art program and, and figure out who I am outside of us. And the only way that I can do that is if, if we don't talk for a while. Okay, you walk out that door and we're done. You're never gonna hear my voice again. But I think we're looking for different things. So live long and prosper, whatever. <laughs> I want to break up. I don't think you're the one for me. <laughs> ah! I'm not the one for you. It's a, it's not like that. I'm just it's it's it's. What? I'm, I'm just like super busy right now. <laughs> I don't like you. I don't like you that way. I used to like you that way, but now that I've seen everything there is to see, I don't know, I kind of want to see those same parts just on other girls. Other girls and you, if you're into that, but the other girls have to be there too. That's the important part. Gosh, you're just terrified of ever getting close to anyone, aren't you? Or that. Let's say it's that. So can I get a gin and tonic? Creed? Oh my god, I have to break up with her. Yeah, it's just... It's not really... Ixnay, you know? Ixnay on what? Not feeling it. Not feeling what? But, but friends and stuff. Oh my god, this is the worst breakup ever. You're breaking up with me? Oh, if that's what you want, I, I totally understand. We need to talk. I like you. We're pretending this works, but it doesn't. And I'm getting a little sick of the whole charade. So maybe we could go back to just being co-workers. Wide open. We need to talk. I just think um, we both could use some space right now. It's not you, it's me. Look, I know this hurts, but you deserve someone better. I'm just I'm really trying to focus on my career right now, you know? I just hope we can still be friends. And what about me? You think I just go around pouring cereal for every boy in town? Why are you getting so upset, Roberta? Robin! My name is Robin! Like the bird, remember? Whatever. Scooter, when I go off to college, that's the end for us. You're... You're breaking up with me? There's still so much I want to do. I got offered the lead anchor job at WNKW in Chicago. Oh. Um. What'd you say? I said yes. Robin, wait, please try to understand. You gotta get out of here. Put yourself in my shoes. Can you imagine what it's like to have the phone ring and it's your dream job on the other end? Yes. I can. Good luck in Chicago, Don. If we really need something this complicated to get married. Yeah. I was anxious to be found. But she's like family to me, and uh, I can't end that. So, can you accept that? I really hope you get her something. If I gave you an out right now, if there was an exit ramp right here at the three-year mark, would you take it? I love you, Robin. And when we got married, I made a vow that I would always tell you the truth. We got divorced. All right. What do you have to say for yourself? I don't know. Sometimes things have to fall apart to make way for better things. We're done here. I cheated on you. I don't even know how to react. I know I don't get any second chances, but you will always be... Was this a, a one-time thing? Can you tell me it didn't mean anything? No.
I was hoping you'd just leave and we could avoid all this. <laughs> We're breaking up? But what about the Peace Corps? Yeah, all this granola business, it was just a phase. Greg's older. He's successful. Oh, she's untied. I got it. <sighs> Yeah, this is over. Here's his home address. But you know what? He works late, so I wouldn't go before 2 or 3 in the morning. Oh, my God, thank you. <laughs> but now I feel wrong keeping this. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't worry about that. That's made of candy. <laughs> Later. My answer is no. Hey, where's Barney? Uh, we broke up. And that was the moment we unlearned that other lesson we had just learned a few seconds ago. Getting back together as friends. I like that. One more for the road. Listen, babe. It's over. What? I'm getting back together with Louise Marsh. Louise Marsh? That's a whore's name if I ever heard one. Listen, babe. It's over. What? I'm getting back together with Louise Marsh. I'm sure your daughter Lucy will come, so it'll be like a, a family trip. Our first trip is our funny little family. So that, that was super exciting. Oh, boy. They crank up the heat in these places. What's going on, Ted? We need to talk. I'm only trying to be honest with you. You know what, Ted? I have to go to work. Stella, can we just, I, I don't want to leave it like this. No, Ted, it's OK. We're good. At the time, I thought the story was about whether Robin should be at the wedding. If only I'd understood what the real story was. I found two wine glasses you didn't smash. <laughs> Call me crazy, but I got a feeling from here on out, it's gonna be nothing but blue skies and... What the hell is this? <laughs> and for the grand finale, I found your fireworks. Let's see what they do to your precious but I could not stop loving her any more than I could stop breathing. I am hopelessly, irretrievably in love with her. More than she knows. Robin, is this true? You heard him. Oh, wow. It feels like I have a pool groin muscle in my heart. Uh-huh, you gotta go. <laughs> hey, you can't just kick me out. I put a lot of work into this place and I've grown accustomed to a certain standard of living. <laughs> standard of living yeah it's full of regret so i need you to be sure okay if we get married you will never have children are you really okay with that you okay years from now we'll all be gone all our friends will she's in a band damn that's cool <laughs> this is unbelievable you just picked out the only three things in here that are my roommates. So does your roommate's band ever Get play out. shows or? <laughs> okay, bye. I thought it was mine, so I answered it. Was it? It was your girlfriend. You might want to call her back. I called Victoria from the cab and we broke up. <laughs> you know what? The wedding's off. We broke up. I would have stolen you a whole orchestra. Throw away the paper. You did break up. Yeah. Karen. Sorry, bro. Karen and I broke up. We hated her. Bitch had to go. Take it. Sorry, bro. How could you? Sorry, bro. Karen broke up. I love you. It's over. Hi, Kara. So you guys are like, back together now? Yeah. Happened last night. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, bro. I should have called you. Yeah, you should have. Well, I didn't mean to hurt. Don't, Brad. Just don't.